uh, challenge we're facing in the urbanized world, which is that of space. The top half of the picture shows a eight-person family living in Hong Kong in less than 300 square foot of space. I know this is not just happening in Hong Kong. We see them happening here even in Mumbai. And the picture below is a project we recently completed, which allows the same 400 square foot apartment to seemingly feel infinite in size using virtual reality. Now, I'm not saying that technology will solve the real tangible space issues, but we know for the fact that as 9 billion people towards the end of the decade will be living in urbanized areas, we will not be able to afford nice garden villas with trees and lovely gardens around us like the Leela. But we may need to use other technologies to bring that to bear so that people can still have that kind of, uh, have that kind of benefit. And the way that we are gonna build is gonna be very different. Even from the video that Sango Baron was showing about the technology and development, makes me wonder about how and what materials will be building the architectures of the future. On the left-hand side is public housing that's been built in Hong Kong since the 1960s, made out of concrete, steel, and glass. On the right-hand side is a new system of building using mostly aluminum that allows the same building with the same capacity to be built at one-fifth of the weight, at one-fifth of the time, at one-half of the cost. These are the advances that are now made available to us as we look at the cyber texture opportunities in terms of urban innovation. We are living in an increasingly connected world. Those issues that we face are connected. We are connected to each other. We share our innovations, we share our ideas. Great innovations and creations that are created maybe in Asia will soon be pervasive in the West, but also the West towards the East. We have much to learn from each other. But most importantly, I believe urban innovation and cyber texture is a movement about collaboration. It is about sharing those problems and challenges that we are seeing and sharing the ideas and the creativity that we have to solve these issues together. No one company, no one society, no one country will be able to solve these by themselves.